Are you ready to unlock the power of airdrop? We'll show you how to airdrop like a pro, ensuring that you can quickly and easily transfer files, photos, videos, and more between your iPhones, iPads, and Macs. Before we dive into the steps, let's make sure your devices are compatible with AirDrop. AirDrop is available on all Macs introduced in 2012 or later, and all iOS devices running iOS 7 or later. To use AirDrop, you need to enable it on both the sending and receiving devices. Here's how. On iPhone or iPad, swipe down from the top of the screen to open Control Center. Keep your finger on the antenna icon. You will see a list of new options. Here you should have the AirDrop option. Keep your finger on the AirDrop icon and select either Contacts Only or Everyone. This will enable the transfer between your devices. Please remember that you need to have this option activated on the receiving device so you can send the file. You can do this also on a Mac. You can activate this feature on the Mac by going also to the Control Center in the right top corner and clicking AirDrop. Now let's find the file you want to send. On the device that you have the file, open the app that has the file you want to share. Let me show you how you can send now a file so I can open the Files app. Locate the file you want to share on your sending device. This could be a photo, video, document, or any other type of file. Find the file you want to share and tap it. Tap the Share button from the bottom left. Select AirDrop. In the Sharing menu, you'll see a list of nearby devices that have AirDrop enabled. Select the device you want to send the file to. If you do not see the device, then it means the AirDrop has not been enabled from the other device. Check to be sure that the AirDrop is set to everyone on the other device. On the receiving device, you'll be prompted to accept the incoming file. Tap on Accept to start the file transfer. You can track the progress of the file transfer in the Control Center on your sending device or in the AirDrop window on your Mac. We have sent a file from your iPhone. Let's see now how we can send a picture from an iPhone with AirDrop. Open the picture by going to your Photos app. Tap on Share from the bottom left. Select AirDrop. In the Sharing menu, you'll see a list of nearby devices that have AirDrop enabled. Select the device you want to send the file to. If you do not see the device, then it means the AirDrop has not been enabled from the other device. Check to be sure that the AirDrop is set to everyone on the other device. On the receiving device, you'll be prompted to accept the incoming file. Tap on Accept to start the file transfer. You can track the progress of the file transfer in the Control Center on your sending device or in the AirDrop window on your Mac. We have sent a picture from your iPhone. Additional tips. Use AirDrop for multiple file transfers. You can select multiple files to AirDrop at once, making it easy to share a collection of photos or documents. Control who can AirDrop your files. By selecting Contacts Only in the AirDrop settings, you can limit file sharing to people in your contacts list. Troubleshoot AirDrop issues. If you encounter any problems with AirDrop, try restarting your devices or checking your Wi-Fi and Bluetooth connections. By following these steps and implementing the additional tips, you'll be able to effortlessly share files between your Apple devices, saving you time and hassle. And that's it for today. If you found this video helpful, please consider leaving a like and subscribe to my channel for more tech tips and tricks. As always, if you have any questions or requests for future videos, drop them in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.